guys! So today I'm going to do a skincare routine video. Uh, my skincare is pretty basic. I wash my face and moisturise in the morning. Uh, I don't tend to wash my, my face at night time at all um, unless I'm wearing makeup which is very rare. Um, I'm not wearing makeup now. I don't wear makeup to work. Uh, I only wear makeup sort of if I've got an event to go to. Um, so my skincare is all by a brand called Philosophy. I really like it. I've been using Philosophy for about four years now. Um, and I found that it's worked really well for me so far. So what I use um, in the shower in the morning is, it's called Purity Made Simple. And this is just their, um, their face wash. I think it's their pretty stock standard face wash. Face wash. Um, and I like it. It's just... You just put it straight on. But to put this on, I have just started in the past sort of six months um, using these. So I don't know if you've seen these before. They're called Ku Cognac. This is um, a new one that I've got. This is what the packaging looks like. And it's actually um, a bit... It's so nice. It's really soft and it's, um, and it's so squishy. I'll show you it's all. Um, and I put it on here and then I wash my face with it and then I rinse this and then I wash off the uh, the face wash with it as well and it just leaves your skin so much softer and nicer and it's got its own pH balance in it so you don't actually have to use any um, cleaning product at all you can just purely use this and water but I just use a little tiny bit of purity um, so it works really well if anyone else uses these I'm about to go away for six weeks and I don't know how to travel with this because you can't um, you can't wring it out. You have to just leave it to dry straight after you've used it. You hang it up and leave it to dry. But um, I don't know how to travel with it because what do you do? You put it in something, or I don't really know what to do. So if you've got any suggestions on what to do with this, that would be ace. Um, after I get out of the shower, having washed my face, I then just use. Um, Hope in a jar, which this comes in a jar as well, but this is um, SPF 25 and it's just a daily moisturiser and it works really well for me, so it's been pretty good so far. I also use um, from Philosophy as well, I Hope, and this is what I Hope looks like. Um, and you just use the small underneath your eyes and just around the side of it. Um, I read somewhere that after you turn 25 is when you need to start really using eye creams to sort of help prevent wrinkles and everything and aging early. Um, so I'm 25, so I've been using this. Um, and I really like it. It makes you, in the morning, it kind of tightens your skin and it kind of makes you wake up a little bit and look less tired. Um, yeah, it wakes you up and you look a lot less tired than you actually feel. So. I really like this product, it's worked really well for me. I am um, thinking about changing my whole um, skincare range to Burt's Bees. I'm not sure if any of you have used Burt's Bees before. I've heard good things about um, some of their ranges. I haven't really read too much into their skincare products, but I do know that they are organic, they are natural, and I really like the idea of that. Um, but I'm not. 100% sure I haven't I have to look into some more reviews but if any of you use Burt's Bees or you know anything about them um, how they differ from philosophy because I don't think philosophy is well it says it's natural but I don't think it's um, as natural as Burt's Bees but uh, it is it's still a good product I really like it um, so if you have any questions or um, comments, please leave them below uh, and I'll speak to you in my next video. Thanks, bye!